Um, it's just that you know you know that there's a natural immediate connection with that other attorney of color, right? You know, you, you, you feel that. Um, and so it's easier to ask them those, some of those questions. Um, but I wouldn't have made it without the white sponsors at my firm. In fact, the, the two partners who helped me the most are white men uh, who are at retirement age now. Uh, so you, know, you need them, and, and they're great sponsors as well. But I say this to say only that being Asian, being a minority, can, is not a hindrance to you. It allows you to stick out. It allows you to show something uh, a lot earlier, frankly, than a lot of other associates, simply because you're visible. You're, you're a little more visible. The negative, the downside to me, is that you get stuck in this minor, model minority myth uh, too often. You get stuck in this, oh, they're Asian, they'll work really, really hard, but they're not necessarily born leaders, they're not natural business developers, they're not people who uh, you can necessarily put up in front of a judge. They're the ones that you want behind the scenes toiling and working their butts off for you. You know, doing the research, doing the writing. Uh, you know, that's the crap you have to deal with. Uh, you know, the other, the other sort of flip side of that is, you know, you also have to work through uh, any other sort of stereotypical stuff that might come up for being Asian. Uh, and a lot of that is just educating. And the more you're out there, the more visible you are, the more you make it normal, the more people are accepting and actually applaud you for it. Uh, so I encourage you to.